Good morning and welcome to Heartland Dual Sport. Today we're on a road trip to Lenora, Oklahoma. It's a, an abandoned town and we're gonna go see what's to see. So let's go ride in the Jeep. Good morning and welcome to Heartland Dual Sport. Again, like Angie was saying, we're gonna be heading to Lenora, Oklahoma, which is a ghost town in Western Oklahoma. And I'll let Angie describe that to you here in a little bit. But a lot of times when people are talking about Western Oklahoma, they think about the national grasslands, the Black, Kesh the Black Kettle National Grasslands is a, is a huge area out in Western Oklahoma. And then you've also got a lot of the flat stuff and then you start getting into uh, the northern part of Texas the further you go west but I, I think of the grasslands and then you also got all the uh, circles out there from the irrigations and the crops that they do out in the flat drier area of this state but one of the things that happened this past spring was there was a huge fire out in western Oklahoma and it consumed several of them almost yeah the one burned for almost two weeks while we was waiting on some rain to come in but I I want to say there was 250,000 acres yeah. or and 60 some odd square miles that was burned up and as you can see we're we're traveling on and I don't remember what highway we're on right now but we're heading out there on maybe sheesh I don't, I don't even remember what highway we'll just have to look if i can figure it out i'll add it but you can look there's just miles and miles of burnt trees and and we don't know for sure we're on our way again we're on our way to lenora and this is part of the red dirt jeeps jeep lahoma is what's got us headed out here to begin with but we we did locate another ghost town and you guys know we love the ghost town so we're heading out here and we want to check that out but right now we don't know if Lenora was actually hit by the fires or not. And according to some of the pictures and stuff we found online, it shows there to be a couple of buildings maybe or something. But anyways, guys, that's where we're heading this morning. I'm gonna let Angie take over. She's gonna kind of narrate a little bit of the history about Lenora and we will keep on driving that way and see, let's go see what we can find out here, guys. Lenora, Oklahoma. Lenora is an unincorporated community in Dewey County, Oklahoma. It is located five and a half miles west of Tologa. The community was founded in 1892 and had a population of 400 in 1900. A post office operated in Lenora from March 24, 1896 until June 30, 1955. So that's the um, statistics that we could find about Lenora, which I guess is more of an abandoned town uh, than a ghost town. But let's go and see what we can see. Did you see any pictures online? What, what did you pull up when you was looking at this? Because part of this, we're actually, like I say, we're, we're heading to another trip, part of the Jeep Lahoma, and I just asked Angie to kind of see if there was ghost towns near us. We didn't. We didn't actually have time to prep for this when we were leaving this morning, but. This is the ghost town of Lenora, Oklahoma. Unfortunately, the two buildings that we were coming to look at have literally been knocked down. So that's sad. That's really sad. Uh, it's a beautiful drive though, so all is not lost. Just kind of sad when you roll up on a ghost town and left. So, Lenora, Oklahoma. Farewell. Okay, and after we left the sad little town of Lenora, we uh, found um, the river. We, we were, so we drove down underneath the bridge, which was kind of neat, and we got out and stretched our legs and walked around, and of course, uh, one of the dogs thought it would be fun to go into the river and then roll around in the mud or well what became mud so that was a lot of fun and 
we got some great pictures there too, though. Just some fun. Yeah, just fun show, stuff. show some of the pictures yeah. of that old railroad track that you. We'll go ahead and throw them up right here. I mean, she. This is really cool. It was just a great find. As you guys know, driving around here in the city, you're not going to get river access to nothing because everything's fenced off, right. gated off. And, it was kind of neat to be able to drive down that dirt road all the way to the water. Can you imagine being a kid growing up out here? Well, right. we appreciate your likes, comments, and subscribes, and may you have a blessed week. Have a blessed week.